Hi, guess what? It's Undie Sunday time again. My name is Jean Corley Wicks and I'm co-chair with Tim Heisberger for the Undie Sunday mission here for North Lake. I'm new to this mission and am amazed at what North Lake has achieved in supporting it over the past eight years. Last year, over 5,800 pairs of undies were collected. That's over 37,000 pairs of undies since 2012, when it was first initiated. You should congratulate yourself. Improving the quality of life in Haiti has been our goal since beginning Undies Sunday eight years ago. Tim and I would like to introduce you to a young girl, Daphne, that has been helped by North Lake. She's six years old. She lives with her, both her parents. She has six brothers and sisters, and they live in a one-room hut with a mud floor. There's no electricity and no running water. This situation is typical for a family in Haiti. Every morning, Daphne and her sister walk one hour each way to the river to bring buckets of water back to the family. The mother goes out to search for food. The father searches for sticks to start a fire. There's no guarantee that there will be any food found for that evening. The father is always searching for a job. In spite of all these hardships, and perhaps because she received some undies from us, little Daphne felt compelled to write us this letter. To church people, thank you for my pretty undies. They keep me from getting worms, and then my tummy doesn't hurt so bad. It feels good to know somebody cares about me and my family. Teacher says that Jesus loves me. Now I know he does. Thank you, from Daphne. For North Lake, requests are simple. One, during the month of February, purchase new underwear and place in the containers that'll be available in the vestibule and outside of the fellowship hall. Two, be sure to bring only children's undies either boys or girls. Three, make sure it's either a print or a color. No white. Remember, no running water, so washing facilities are minimal at best. It is difficult for us to comprehend the overwhelming poverty in Haiti. Can you imagine actually selling your own child in order to have food for the rest of the family? In February, our second mile offering is donated to Love a Child Mission in order to help eradicate hunger. The final day for our collection will be February 23rd. And I'd like to thank you ahead of time for your compassion in donating to this worthy cause.